Top story tonight, a local Navy sailor accused of murder in Virginia Beach. According to court documents, a crack cocaine bender leading to that murder. And the murder weapon? A dumbbell. The sailor, along with a woman, both facing charges tonight. News 3 investigator Zach Dahlheimer joins us live in the studio. And Zach, you got your hands on court documents that shed new disturbing details in this case. Yeah, Kurt, these documents right here, especially detailing that are related to Jason Jablonski. Now, he's the sailor assigned to Naval Station Norfolk, charged with second degree murder. The victim, Herbert Bryant and Heather Toddy, who's been charged with accessory to murder after the fact. Now, we want to warn you, some of what you're about to hear may be uncomfortable to hear. I can't even process that right now. Because that, to me, I mean, you know, when you say that, I don't, I can't process that. Tyrone Hall can barely comprehend what happened to his next door neighbor and fellow sailor, Jason Jablonski, charged with second degree murder for the death of a Virginia Beach man, Herbert Bryant. This is overwhelming. I'm really overwhelmed right now. I, I'm just starting to hear any of this, really, and I just can't connect the dots when we are talking about processing that, not him, because he don't, didn't have, the characteristics doesn't match what, what we're saying here. Hall says he knew Jablonski as an outstanding neighbor, husband, father, and sailor assigned to Naval Station Norfolk. As a sailor, we, we were bros. We always called each other brother and, and got a beautiful family. I thought he was a stellar sailor, too, because uh, I, I think he was doing really well in the Navy. 35-year-old Heather Toddy has also been charged with accessory to murder after the fact. It's just terrible, man. Tyler Bellamy recalls seeing tape around his neighborhood at the Eastwick Village Apartments when police responded just after 7.30 Friday morning. He literally probably 50, 60 percent are older people. So it's very surprising to see something like this happen. This week, News 3 got court documents revealing new details as to what's believed to have happened. For Jablonski, documents say he was on a crack bender when he got into a fight with Bryant, beat Bryant in the face with a dumbbell, and pushed the dumbbell down on Bryant's neck until Bryant stopped moving, before dragging Bryant's body outside and then fled to a hotel. Jablonski, documents say, had no previous convictions. For Toddy, documents tell us she was present when Jablonski murdered Bryant and helped drag Bryant's body outside. Toddy also attempted to clean up the scene and collect all of Bryant's stuff in a bag. Documents go on to say Bryant's stuff was found in a dumpster. According to documents, Toddy's prior criminal record includes fraud, accessory, burglary, and contempt. For Bellamy, security is key moving forward in the neighborhood. Made me want to get two rings, you know, one on my front door. I already got one in my house. As for Hall, just a precious family, you know, and, and wow, I am terribly sorry. Something of this magnitude could happen. Now, the relationship between Brian Jablonski and Toddy is unclear. Now, if you have any information about this case, you can contact Crime Solvers or Virginia Beach Police. We have all that info up right now on our website, WTKR.com. Zach Dahlheimer, News 3.